Well, it comes down to the drought. The Bureau of Reclamation says a low water storage and low snowpack is to blame. I spoke to some local farmers today who say the federal government just doesn't understand the dire situation that California is in. Not as a surprise, but we'd hoped for better. Anything is better than zero for local farmers like Paul Betancourt. No water allotment from the federal government means no crops. I have neighbors uh, pushing trees out. Um, it, it's just brutal. Betancourt says receiving no water as part of this allocation means he'll have to rely on groundwater. But even that is sparse. Well, this, this is definitely affecting what everybody's planting. Um, we're okay. We've got a plan for this year. Um, but like I said, you know, neighbors are pushing trees out. So how is this going to affect you? Betancourt says produce prices are sure to increase because supply and demand will be so high. Local economies that rely on agriculture may suffer as well. My first thought is it sucks. Uh, there's no other way to put it. Orange Cove City Mayor Victor Lopez is concerned. We are farm worker communities, okay? We depend solely on agriculture. That's our economy, those are our jobs, those are our families, our schools. Everybody's going to be impacted enormously. And I'm, as a mayor of my city, I'm very disappointed. The Fresno County Farm Bureau says though Mother Nature has been dry, there is water available for distribution. However, the Bureau of Reclamation says Central Valley Project Reservoirs are only at 26% capacity. They call the 0% allocation an unfortunate and unprecedented situation. The Fresno County Farm Bureau says farmers will still have to pay the Bureau of Reclamation even though they have received 0% allocation. Now, farmers can, of course, buy water and ship it in from other places, but that will, of course, add to their bottom line. In East Central Fresno tonight, Connie Tran, KC24, Local News That Matters.